With that said, by the power given to me here in the state of Nevada, it is now my honor and my privilege to pronounce you husband and smartphone. Congratulations to both of you. you walk your bride. If we're going to be honest with ourselves, we connect with our phones on so many emotional levels. We look to it for solace, to calm us down, uh, to put us to sleep, to ease our minds. And to me, that's also what a relationship is about. So, in a sense, my smartphone has been my longest relationship. <laughs> that's why I decided to see what it was like to actually marry a phone. So I'm here in Vegas, I've got this plan, and we contacted a local chapel to see if they'd be willing to perform this slightly unorthodox ceremony, and they weren't just open to it, I think they were really excited about the prospect. It's something different, it's something new, and we're going to make our way over to the ceremony very soon. I'm trying to ask the hard questions of myself as to what this relationship means, and I'm trying to go as far as I can to explore that. We are gathered here today in Las Vegas on this very exciting and joyous occasion to witness and celebrate the joining of Aaron and his smartphone. Think of all of the love and laughter you have shared, all of the good times you've had, all the reasons you're here today at this altar, pledging your eternal love and commitment to each other. Now, do you, Aaron, take this smartphone to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. And do you also promise to love her, honor her, comfort and keep her, and be faithful to her? I do. If you will, I'm going to ask you to place the ring on your bride's finger and your finger. And repeat after me, please. With this ring, with this ring, I thee wed, I thee wed, I promise to love you, I promise to love you, and cherish you, and cherish you, all the days of my life, all the days of my life. It's not yet legal to marry smartphones, but what I hope my wedding will do is to somehow act as a symbolic gesture to show how precious our phones are becoming in our daily lives and hopefully get others to ask that same question of themselves and their relationships to their phones.